Hey, so what's going on everybody? So another short video here I wanted to share with you guys on how to set your Windows computer to boot from DVD or CD. Now I'm using a Windows Vista Compact Presario laptop to do this demonstration on. So let's go ahead and get started. What you want to do is go into your system BIOS in order to set the computer to boot from DVD or CD. So in order to do that, you need to restart the computer. And on this particular system, I have to press the F10 key repeatedly once the computer starts to reboot. And I will wait till it gets past the shutting down. Now I will start pressing F10 repeatedly until I get into the system BIOS. And I will show you in there where you can change your boot order. Okay, that got me into what is called the system BIOS and what you want to do in here is you have some stuff across the top and you use the arrow keys on your keyboard and you can go through this stuff back and forth um, basically it is going this is an older style BIOS here this is like an older style uh, laptop also I'm using but this is generally how you do it you go in here and you find it somewhere in your boot configuration or your you know boot um, system configuration what you want to look for is something over here called like boot options. So select that, click enter. And then what you want to do is come down to where it says boot order. So, you know, all some of the BIOS look different. So you guys will have to kind of look or search around for something here called boot order within your system BIOS. So now you can see that the DVD ROM drive on mine is set to boot first. So down here is how you, you just go through and use your F keys and you can change values. So if I highlight this DVD CD one and I want to make that second, I just press F5, it says here F5 change values, that pushes it down. If I want it to boot third, I'll just keep pressing it down. So what I want to do is set it to boot from CD DVD first. So I will F F6 or F5, whatever gets it to the top, now it's first in position to boot um, from for my boot order. So what you want to do now is over here it says F10, save and exit. Just press F10, save configuration changes, and make sure you have yes selected, and just press enter. Now in the beginning here, I'm going to press pause. I want to show you guys something. If you press your pause button, your pause key, right about now, I pressed it, because this screen usually goes by so quick you can't see what all this stuff down here on the bottom says. But there's a lot of helpful information down here. And it gives you a listing of all your commands, like all your F keys to press to get in to do certain things. F9 to change boot device order. You can actually go, you can actually press F9, get in and change your boot order that way as well. But you guys should have something similar to this somewhere on your boot up screen somewhere here in the screen one in the corners or something when your computer you know when your computer first restarts and then that will tell you which key which f key you need to press to get into your bios it, a lot of the common ones um, are like escape f1 f2 or f10 are common keys for getting in to the system bios to change your boot order and to boot from DVD. So that is pretty much all I have for you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and restart the computer here. Let it finish starting up. And that is pretty much all you guys need to do. And thanks a lot guys for watching. I hope you guys uh, subscribe, comment, and like my video. And have a great one. Thanks.